Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Angry Hippie Lady, and we are back here in the Telltale Walking Dead game. And we need to talk to a couple more people before we do go out. I want to make sure I get all the information I can. Hey, Haley, found anything interesting? I was talking to Andy a bit earlier. Doesn't sound like they have too many guns around. They rely mostly on the fence to keep them safe. So long as you're on this side, things are all right, provided the fence holds out. Well, that's the problem. When there's no more gas, there's no more fence. That's true. Well, it's good to know what we're working with here. Keep looking around. And let me know if you find anything else. How you holding How up? You holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? Lily doesn't want to be I here. Guess, uh, Lily isn't too thrilled about being here. I could give two shits about what Lily wants. Duck and Katja need food, and I'm not about to sit around that motor inn and watch him go hungry. You're with me on this, right? Yeah, of course. Lily's judgment is clouded, but you've got a pretty clear head about these things. I'm just playing nice. Because I feel like Lily and her father are gonna go off and die or something like that, so I need to be friends with Kenny. Did Family Duck made and here okay? get here okay? Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Katja could have an easier life here. That's funny, considering you didn't seem too worried about Duck back at Herschel's farm. That's in the past, Kenny. A lot's happened since then. Yeah, right. Oh, I'm man. Go have a get out. Here. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Gotta like click it mid swing to be able to look at the stupid swing. They look happy. <laughs> and that's all you get. What's that? Look at electric fence. Okay. Let's use this gate. Go talk to these guys. This is a big hill. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, I'm really sorry you almost got killed out there. Where's Mark? We should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? We don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Let's go. Yeah. It'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. No, you gotta stay here, little one. Are you going now? Yes. Yeah, I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. Hmm... <laughs> Oh. God, she breaks my heart so easily. See anything? Not yet. I know it's around here. It's got to be close. How do you know? There's some soup. Here. Ooh. Oh shit. You yeah, that's something. It? That's something for sure. I I don't think this, this is them. See anybody? I don't think this is them, guys. Looks empty. Looks empty. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tent. Uh, mm, don't. Ah, uh, 
don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't. Mm -mm. Nope. 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 Don't look in there. Oh, there's no one in there. Clear. You sound so sad. Too small. Can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. Alright, let's go look at this. It's a crate. And there's some milk bottles by it. Nothing. There's some empty mi milk bottles. Didn't look at it. Empty. Why did he do that? Let's look in there. Tent looks pretty new. Anybody inside? Two sleeping bags. One of them's kid sized. Can I actually look in? Looks like they expected to be here a while. I want to be able to look in there and see what's in there. Like mm. with Lee's eyes. Looks like they were moving a lot of stuff. Well, look at all these boxes! What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Unless you need empty cans. It's too much for one this person. Is too much stuff for just one person. Trust me, these selfish bastards don't stop taking. Probably just to remind us that it's theirs. What's in here? That's from the dairy. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. Fuckers cross the line. There's a recorder. What do you find? Oh, it's a camera. A video camera. Let me see that. No. I wouldn't look at Battery's it. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Now can we go look in the tent? Now that he's away from it? Yeah. You guys didn't hear that. What's this? Some little, little stuff. Oh, here. man. God, is there gonna be a dead kid? I can't handle that. I can't handle seeing dead kids. <clears throat> Hey, let's come in time's head. Don't you fucking move. Whoa. Shit. Put your guns down. I ain't going back. If you tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. Who the Who fuck are, are you? you? <laughs> Look, it's not safe up here in the woods. You gotta come back to the dairy. <laughs> oh, it's a hell of a lot safer up here than down there, you best believe. Now, maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I'm gonna kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. This woman is crazy. Brain. You're not men. You're monsters. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Where'd you get it, Clementine? Wait. It's all the fucking same to you. Did I pick Where it? did you get this yeah. hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What? 
What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn person Don't I be see. stupid. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is gonna kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind for- Oh! Oh, God. I didn't choose the shooter! Oh, you chose not to. Okay, okay. God Ooh. damn it! You murdered her! You straight up murdered that woman! Hardly. She had a crossbow pointed at my forehead. She was pointing at me when you shot her. <sighs> Thank you for shopping at Steve Lots. <laughs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, we head back. Hmm. Once they see this, they'll get the message. She wasn't with them. Take the crossbow. Don't let him take the crossbow. Come on. God, I miss shooting bow and arrows. I need to get my bow fixed. And I need new arrows. Man, that was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back! What happened? Handled it, Mama. Where's Mark? This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, Princess. I'll do it myself. What is going on What's with you two? Don't know. Squabbling looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Uh, don't mind them. It's how they are. Each of them wants to be in charge, you know? Well, it's probably just the hunger talking. We all get a little testy. We'll fix that shortly. Where's Mark? Henry, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. I think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lifesaver. So I assume I can go to the barn now. Can I talk more to this woman? Guess not. Game's sending me away from her. Good. Clementine is alive. Oh, she's so cute. Don't close the door! <sighs> Anybody over here I can talk to? You. We need to talk. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. You really like that gun? You really like that gun. What's not to like? It's just it's a gun. It's just a gun. That's where you're wrong. This is Charlotte. She's as faithful as a starving hound when you got a bone in your pocket. Ooh. Um. You guys are pretty out in the sticks here. Hard to find. You get many visitors? Not anymore. Bandits, of course. Used to get these school kids on tours back before the dead time. You run this place with just one cow? How do you run this place with just one cow. Used to have more. They get hungry too. Or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. 
I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. He's creepy. Yeah, let's look at the swing. Might as well. All fixed. That should make everyone happy. No, 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 don't, don't talk to her. I'm not. I don't want to talk to her quite yet. Anything new about that? Oh, look, there's something over here. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. That's true. I guess that's the thing, but... Apparently I can look at this now. It's a small toolbox. <clears throat> Maybe it has some small tools. Take it. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. I don't know why, but, I mean, if it's gonna allow me to pick something up, I'm gonna take it. Darn too. Alright, let's go through here. See if we can uh, talk to these guys. Maybe a little bit more. I don't know. They might have something new. Something new to talk about. Hey, so what happened at the camp? Did you guys find any more of those guys that hurt Mark? Danny shot someone. We found a woman in the woods. She was talking all crazy and had a crossbow, so Danny killed her. Holy shit. Was she one of those bandits? I don't know. I think she was trying to tell me something. But then, he just went off. I don't like this, Lee. I still say we should go back to the motor inn, where we at least know what to expect. We need food. What were you and Kenny arguing over? What were you and Kenny <coughs> arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? We are guests here. We don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Do you get the feeling something's going on here? Do you get the feeling something's going on here? What makes you say that? What exactly happened at the camp? Uh, it's nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Paranoia just getting to me a little bit. No, worry you know about it. I mean, these backwoods people always give me the creeps. If you ask me, we should just get our dinner and leave. Come on now. We don't want to be rude. I'm going to go check things out. Just don't get too nosy. These kinds of people are usually pretty protective of their privacy. Yeah, you already said that. All right, let's go in the barn and see what's going on in there. Um, see the cow, I guess. See Clementine with the cow. See how cute everything is. Ooh, that was weird. <laughs> it's super dark in there, apparently. It's not too dark. I don't think cows lay like that. That's a small cow. It's not very big. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. Yeah, it's okay. It's okay, go ahead. It's not gonna hurt you. Cows are pretty... Whoa. Pretty nice. Katya says Mabel could have a baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. Oh wow, the, the cow's pregnant. What's this thing? Danny said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? Did you lick it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> she did! Oh my gosh, she's so freaking precious. Oh, I love her. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. How's the cow? How's the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. Uh, when do you think we might eat? Um, when do you think, uh, we might eat? Hungry, huh? <laughs> Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. Where's Mark? Danny and I met a woman in we the woods. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than y'all. Thanks. Yep. All right, look at the cow. She looks skinny. Talk to the duck. Have I missed anything? No, not really. Hmm, it smells funny in here. Like manure. What's manure? Duty. 
<laughs> Kids. <laughs> They're just having fun. <laughs> Let them laugh. There's not much to laugh about these days. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Here, Clementine. My hat! Yep. I found it! Found your hat. I knew you'd find it. Of you course. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee. Good. Do you think you'll ever have kids? I haven't thought about it in a while. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. No, pet the cow with her. Oh my god. Interact with her more, man. Is there anything in any of these? Is there any point in me looking in all these? Because they I can look in all of them. I wanna put in the hay. Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. <laughs> Get out of here, kid. <clears throat> I don't know, guys. I I don't know how I feel about this place. Oh, there's some boxes. Are they save lot boxes? No, they're for the they're for the dairy. Empty. Alright. Can I look at these across the way? Nope. If I come over here. Oh, I can now. It's in here. Wait, what is that? There's a sh what? Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. That'd be some dead people clothes right there. Somebody died. Oh, what feed why can't I look at this feeding trough and not it's the a others? Trough. Th thanks. Thanks, Lee. Always helpful. Always very observant. Okay, I can look in this one. Is there anything else? Oh. What? That's not very helpful. It's all up in my way. Hey, Lee. Oh, wait, there was something to look at. <laughs> there. There was something, like, right here. I saw it. Just some fence posts. Wow. Get out. Alright, let's go back and look at this thing then. Because it's all the way to the back. I wanted to save that for last. Ooh. You found it too, huh? That's creepy. Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm mm -hmm. right now. Mm-hmm. How about you? What about Clem? Mm-hmm. I'll protect her no matter what. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know how to pick a lock, right? No. Why would you say that? Well, you're... You know, urban? Oh, get out. You are 
you're not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Dang Floridans. Hmm. What? See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have them peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right. Good. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? No. We're good. Just checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, mm -hmm. the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Alright, guys. I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here, though. Um, thank you all for watching. I'm Angry Hippie Lady, and I will see you in the next episode. Peace out, everyone.